Hi! Thank you so much for coming back to watch my second video. This one we're going to do three simple looks. So these looks are going to focus on the lips, a quick eye, and headbands. So these looks are really good if you're running late and you just want to throw yourself together really quickly and still make an impact, which is good because you don't always have time to do a full face of makeup or really think together an outfit. So this is going to be our first look of the day. And for each look, I did already have it prepped with my foundation, so I did use my Cover FX. And then the mascara I used is Tarte. It's their Lights, Camera, Flashes, so it's in the gold case. And then I also did, for those of you who have to do your brows, it's an everyday, you just have to. The Gimme Brow by Benefit is awesome because it has this little tiny brush here. So it's good on the days where you don't have time to really fill them in. It just gives you a little bit of color and it gives them um, a little bit more fullness as well. So that's a great product to have when you're running low on time. Okay, so here we go. Let me start with the first look. First step is the Kat Von D liner in Trooper. And we line that up right at the edge of the nose just so we can figure out where the end of that wing will be. And then we draw that line straight down because that'll just be the tip of the wing. And then we go across the lash line. Now I do have this in a little bit of a fast motion. So definitely take your time when you're doing the liquid eyeliner. So we're just going to do the outline of the wing and really just fill that in. Kind of like you're just coloring in a coloring book. And you could go a little bit more dramatic on this if you wanted to as well. Now we're going to move straight to the lips. And we're going to start off with Makeup Forever's Aqua Lip in 12C. So it's a really deep purple liner. And we're going to start off by doing the outline of the lip. And by doing the outline, we're just really keeping that lipstick in place. It's not going to feather out. It's not going to end up all over your face. In this liner, I also fill it all the way in just because it does help to keep all the lipstick lasting the entire day too. It's completely waterproof, so it's one of my favorite liners to use when I'm doing a darker lip. And then we are going to layer this lipstick right on top. It's the Wet n Wild Raven Raisin. It's their matte collection, and it just makes the lips a little bit deeper. It's a really pretty color. For our look today, is just to add a nice little headband. Now this is more of a hair chain. I got it at Claire's and it really does add a little bit extra to the look and it just finishes it off. So our first look is complete and that didn't take very long. So now we'll move right on to look number two. So we're starting with the eyes. The first step is the Buxom Stay There Eyeshadow in Golden Retriever. It's more like a cream eyeshadow. It's a really fun texture. So you just, I put it on with my fingers. It gives me a little bit more control with it. So I'm just putting that right on the lid. It's a really pretty copper color. And then we're going to move on to my NARS palette. So this is called In God Created the Woman set. It's that first shade. So it's a nice light neutral with a little bit of shimmer. So I'm just doing that right at the crease where we ended the buxom shade and kind of just blending that up. Next I am going to add a little bit of eyeliner in the waterline at the top and the bottom. It's the Urban Decay 24-7 Glide On Eye Pencil in Zero, so that's their black shade. And for the lips, we're starting with Revlon. It's their Colorstay Lip Liner in Plum. And we will 
be using a stain as well. So I'm just going to outline the outside of the lip because this is right around the same color as the stain, so this will just keep it in place, and it's a little easier to apply it too. So the stain is from Sephora. It's their cream stains. This one is in Endless Purple. They do dry matte, and it's a really pretty color. This is my favorite lip. It's always my go-to lip because it stays on all day, and it's really easy to put on. And the next step is going to be the headband. Now this is a turban style headband. I believe it's from Claire's or Charlotte Russe. I know they both have a lot of headbands that I've gotten recently. And then we're just adding a little bit more mascara just to finish off the eyes. So I did want a fuller lash with this look. All right, on to look number three. It's a little bit more daring. So we're starting off just by priming the eyes with our Urban Decay Primer Potion because we are going to go for more of a glittery eyeshadow. So we definitely want that to stay. And this is the Revlon Diamond Dust. So we're just going to tap that right into where we applied the primer. And next, to brighten up the eyes a little, we're using the Makeup Forever Aqua Shadow Pencil in 30E, so it's a pinky beige color. And then we're going to line the top waterline with Urban Decay Zero again. And then for the lips, it is Lime Crime De Lilac, so it's a really, really fun purple shade. This is the first time I'm wearing it. So I'm really excited. It's pretty opaque too, which I was not expecting. So you really don't even need to prime this with a lighter shade. It does give you a nice finish. And then we're going to top it off with a nice flower headband. And I'm not sure where this is from. I got it as a gift for Christmas this year. And I'm sure you noticed that I did focus more on berry and purple toned lips today. And I did that because purple lips have been really popular this entire past year. So I did want to give you a little bit of a range with those. So I do have some other purples here that I wanted to swatch for you guys just so you had a few different options when you are doing these looks. The ones I used today the first one was that Wet n Wild, so that was my darkest, so that is a matte. And then with our stain from Sephora, that one does dry matte, it's a little lighter, but you could pair it with a dark lip liner. And then of course we had our Lime Crime. So that really gives you that bright, beautiful purple. And then I do have some other options for you. I have one from Maybelline. It's called Brazen Berry. So that one has more of a pink tone to it. And then of course there's Buxom, the Acapulco. So this one does have a matte look as well. So it's pretty and it's a plumper which is always fun. And L'Oreal, I have a little bit of a stain. It's really light though. This one is Stubborn Plum. So that one's a little sheer, but you could build it up too. Let's see. So that's nice. And then I have another stain from Revlon. It's their color stay over time in Relentless Raisin. So that one is pretty dark. All right, well, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys try these looks out. They're a lot of fun, and I'll see you next week.